Shalom, Israel. <laughs> shalom, shalom. Shalom. Let me get some coffee. All right. Well, I can feel that the spirit is putting me through a test here. And uh, before I get started, all praises, all honor, all glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakakodash. Yahweh is our Heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai is the Savior, whose name means He delivers, who people call Him all kinds of names that aren't His. And the Rakakodash is the Holy Spirit that gives. The 144,000 elect men, the ability to push out these hard truths, these these unwanted truths in these dangerous, perilous, ridiculously lonely times. So the issue I'm having here is that, uh, you know, uh, the men of Great Millstone aren't, aren't helping me out any, even though, from what I can tell, what usually happens in God's kingdom is, uh, Yahweh Shai will um, is gonna is gonna hurt the people who don't listen, <laughs> and I've been trying to get these guys' attention without causing some kind of um, major conflict, and it seems like that's the only thing they like. They like, they like major conflict because they're just like, they're becoming a lot like the rest of the world. They, they want to talk about stuff that's not, not as important to people's um, salvation as they do about their own power in the word or whatever it is they're doing. I don't know. I still can't understand exactly why... Um, um, if I'm saying the same things they're saying, if I don't put that GMS in front of my ma name, that makes all the difference in the world. That doesn't mean fuck. It doesn't mean fuck. Your fucking little GMS thing. You're like a you're like a bunch of cholos or something, a bunch of um, ninja cholos. If you're not in the, if you don't fit in the burrito, if you're not one of the beans and you don't belong in the burrito, dude, I am the fucking sauce of the burrito, you bitches. Fucking tired of, tired of you not fucking recognizing me, but that's fine. I, I'll keep saying it over and over again. Not one of you pricks has fucking said, S subscribe to my channel. Not one. Some of you fuckers have... 2,000 subscribers, whatever, I don't know, a lot, enough that you could, um, you know, if you're going to feed the sheep, feed the sheep, anyway, I'm, I'm not going to go into this much anymore, I'm, I'm just going to do what I do, and the, and the message today is, you fuckers just don't listen, I, I don't have to pull it, I don't, I'm only going to do a few because I could I could say this till Yahweh Shai comes back. It's not going to make any difference until he lifts me up, and you have to fucking go. Oh fuck! I I'm not doubting it. I'm not no hopeful elect. Hopeful elect. I I have more faith than that. Hopeful elect. Fucking game. 
1723. Jeremiah, let me get in the right book since I'm here. Oh, shit. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Just exasperated by, by the fact that no one, no one even cares about the power. No one even cares about the power. Unbelievable, this world is walking in gross darkness and that's the way it's gonna be I just have to get used to it these are gonna just be precepts on not listening not listening not when I say tell people you don't even have enough nerve to tell people and I'm on here putting my face up here my <laughs> my ugly beat up face. I'm getting I'm getting old. I noticed, I'm getting tired and old because I'm sick and tired of this place. These are just gonna be precepts about not listening. Jeremiah, verse chapter seventeen, verse twenty three. But they obeyed not, neither inclined their ear, but made their necks stiff that they may not hear nor receive instruction. Simple. Uh, 610. Same book. Jeremiah, you know, I'm starting to think I might be Jeremiah in the, um, in the regeneration. Because I'm a sad sack. And I, I, I could pull up so many places in Jeremiah where no one's listening to the guy. No one's listening to the guy. I, I could, there's, there's at least 12 scriptures where Jeremiah says, you're not listening, you're not listening. Six ten. To whom shall I speak and give warning? Jeremiah 6.10, it reads, To whom shall I speak and give warning that they may hear? Who? Who? Who's, who's going to... Listen. To whom shall I speak and give warning that they may hear? Behold, their ear is uncircumcised, and they cannot hearken... Behold, the word of Yahweh power is unto them a reproach. They have no delight in it. The word of Yahweh power is a reproach. And people have no delight in it. You know how I know? You know how I know I'm, I'm the elect? You know how I know I'm the 144? Because there's no one out here like me. No one. I mean, they are. They are. I, mean, I shouldn't say that. But, um... If... If... If the two sticks don't come together and we aren't helping each other, I don't know if these Judites think that I'm a... Uh, um, Northern tribe, triber, I'm not. I'm southern tribe, just like you niggas. Don't look like you, but do I have to look like you? Do I have to join your little stand on the corner group? Do you think I might not know just about as much scripture as you? Do you think that the spirit might not come stronger onto me at some point than you? Do you, you don't, you don't consider that? Possibly, maybe, somewhere in your thick. Skulls? Uh, th this is this is the stuff that um, that makes it makes me realize how how many people are going to perish. People are going to perish because they don't even there's not even there's not even this much of a push for my own people to help push the word. 
All I'm doing, all I'm doing is reading the Bible and telling you what it means. In these last days, that's all I'm doing, just like the rest of you ninjas. Huh? Pretty fucking sick. I'm not going to beg you. The Lord doesn't beg. Judah ignores warnings of prophets. Oh, Judah. Judah ignores the warnings of the prophets. Yeah, you Judites. You ignoring the warning from one of the prophets? Could be. 25-7. Yet ye have not hearkened unto me. Says the Lord. Yahweh power. He's in me. He's asking you, are you going to listen? Are you? Do I have to get just disgusted and um, act like a jackass? Is that what you want? You want to push me to be less than I could be? Is that what you want? You don't want me to be more than I could be? Yet ye have not hearkened unto me, said the Lord, Yahweh power, that ye might provoke me to anger with the works of your hands to your own hurt. One more time. This is called Judah ignores the warnings of the prophets. Get it? Judah? And it reads, Yet you have not hearkened unto me, says Yahweh Power, that ye might provoke me to anger with the works of your hands to your own hurt. Dumb motherfuckers. I'm not, I'm not doing these videos with all this all this fucking cartoon bullshit on there and all this background music and and five guys sitting around a table with their fucking superhero garments on just a dude out here prophesying brother just a dude out here prophesying and if you don't want to listen I'll be waving my hand at you. How you like that? 619. I could do this all day. Jeremiah 619. Hear, O earth. Behold, I will bring evil upon this people. Even the fruit of their thoughts, because they have not hearkened unto my words, nor to my law but rejected it. I'll just keep going. There's another precept here that um, follows. I'll read it again. And it reads, Jeremiah 6, Salakia. Salakia, brothers. Fucking getting pissed, so pissed. I'm trying to do this sh fucking work and getting no help from my own fucking brothers. I'm going to lay back and just wait. Just wait and see. You know what's probably going to happen? All you ninjas are going to get rounded up because they're going to call you some kind of... <laughs> they're going to call you some kind of hate group. <laughs> Thank God I'm not one of you. Let them round you all up and I'll be the last man standing. That's, that's probably what's going on here. The Lord's protecting me from you. It's no such thing. There's no team in prophet. Read that one again. 19 of, of Jeremiah 6. Hear, O earth. All the earth. All the great, great, greatest millstone. <laughs> all over the earth. You guys are everywhere, right? Everywhere. Hear, O earth, behold, I will bring evil upon this people. Even the fruit of their thoughts. 
even in your mind, even in your heart, it's going to twist you up like a ball. It twists you up. Even the fruits of their thoughts, because they have not hearkened unto my words, nor my law, but rejected it. Verse 20. To what purpose cometh there to me incense from Sheba, and the sweet came from a far country? Your burnt offerings are not acceptable, nor your sacrifices sweet unto me. Know what he's saying there? He's saying you can play all these games with uh, Sakari and IUICJ and FUCK and all these other uh, gorilla uh, monkey camps. These Judites that are just bugged out. You're more you're more worried about arguing with bugged out um, ninjas than you are actually talking about what's going on here. Yeah, the world's falling to shit and Yahushai's come to judge and what are you guys doing? Piddle pattering around. You know, last night I was looking for messages. You know, I put out sometimes I put out three messages a day. The order from uh, Apostle Tahar was to put out a message a day. I couldn't even find a message last night. I got I got bored. Looking. I kept looking, looking. Is anyone going to put up a, a message? Are all you ninjas too worn out from your weekend standing on the corner to put out a message? Maybe you should stay home and, and study more and put out a message. All right, um, let's see what we got to finish off Psalm 108. I'm just going to read it through and then say goodbye. I don't have much more to say. Psalm 108, praise the exalted Yahweh power, a song of David. Oh, Yahweh power, my heart is fixed. I will sing and give praise even with my glory. Awake! Psalstry and harp, I myself will awake early. I will praise thee, O Lord, Yahweh power, among the people. And I will sing praises unto thee among the nations. For thy mercy is great above the heavens, and thy truth reaches unto the clouds. Be thou exalted, O Yahweh power, above the heavens and thy glory above all the earth that thy beloved may be delivered save with thy right hand and answer me Yahweh power has spoken in his holiness I will rejoice I will divide Sechem and met out the valley of Succoth Gilead is mine Manasseh is mine Ephraim also is the strength of mine hand and my head. Judah is my lawgiver. Moab, Moab is my washpot. Over Edom I will cast out my shoe. Over Philistia will I triumph. Who will bring me into the strong city? Who will lead me into Edom? Wilt not thou, O Yahweh power, who hast cast us off? And wilt not you, O Yahweh, go forth with our hosts? Give us help. Give us help from trouble, for vain is the help of men. I just opened to that. I just, I, let me read that again. Give us help from trouble. For vain is the help of men. Verse 13, I'm finishing out. Through Yahweh power, we shall do valiantly. For he 
it is that shall tread down our enemies. Do I make you my enemy because I tell you the truth, GMS? Do I make you my enemy? That's up to you. Give us help from trouble, for vain is the help of men. Sorry about the Salakia for the video. I think I have a little bit of uh, perspiration on the camera from all the sweat I've been going through, doing all the work. <laughs> Shalom, Israel. Good luck. Better, better get in those scriptures, boys. Start thinking about it. J.D. Nija out.